So this is 25. Come on. Could this be the one? You need to get three of a kind. Okay, 88. All right, that's two purses. Steph Curry. Oh, what? Oh, oh, oh. That is how we're going to do it today. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Previously on Locker Nuts, I bought this locker at the auction for $1,800. I'm calling it four days on the hunt because in four days of auctions, this is the one and only unit I wanted. It's a big 10 by 20 locker full of totes and it looked clean and very well organized. I pulled the trigger because of a few high-end items I spotted initially, but it has turned out even better than I hoped. The family that owned it spent lots of money and this locker was filled with high-end merchandise. I even found hundreds in cash and gift cards. I'm still trying to see if we can average $100 per tote because if we can do that I stand to make over 10 grand on this unit. Let's see what we find today. You ready to start some more unboxing? So yesterday, oh man it was so hot yesterday. Uh, today probably not going to be any better. Tomorrow probably the hottest day of the week. Right now there's some helicopters buzzing around that's a really bad sign that sometimes means that there's potentially um fires so getting close to that fire season here in california so anyways let's get started this is where we left off yesterday check this out got a little uh all right four dollar i whatever eyelash crimper oh here's a perfume hollister oh hollister perfume yeah look at that hollister perfume nice all right that's good if we can find more perfume we can have in a little perfume lot in our Monday night auction coming up. Yeah, that's good. Okay, what else we got? Okay, what's this? This is also some sort of perfume bottle. It's empty though. Hmm, it's too bad. Ooh, troublemaker. Looks like a Snicker. Oh, it is Snickers. Why are they call it troublemaker? It sounds like my type of trouble right there. Nah. Too old. This stuff in this locker, I've been, uh, you've seen me try some of the stuff, but it's been nasty. Nasty. I've had some really, really terrible stuff, so I don't, I don't feel like trying it again. Some more hotel soaps and stuff. I've got a nice bin started over there. Ooh, okay, look at that. Mac. Got a bunch of cards in here. Alright, let's hope we can find something good. And by good, I mean something green like money like we found before let's hope some of these cards are loaded up i don't think so but yeah we'll see huh we will see uh roll the fast forward please Okay, that's kind of kind of a bust, but what do we got right here? Let's check this out. So these were all like graduation cards, and that's actually a good thing because graduation is one of those events that uh, people do typically give money. So um, that's a good. That's good. That's what you want to find. I did find a few stamps. Six stamps. It's about three bucks. All right, but what do we have here? One little envelope had some gift cards. Kohl's. All right, Kohl's. Doesn't have an amount on it, but we'll see if that's got anything. Okay, ooh, I like that right there. Star, oh, wait a second, I just about threw that away. That's Kohl's, and it says $50 balance on it. Let's use it, here's a Starbucks. It doesn't, it's never been open, like, so it says 25. Come on, could this be the one? Here's an Amazon, it says 30 bucks on the back right here. And here's another Kohl's, it must have liked Kohl's, 50 bucks. All right, all right, that's really good. Maybe 155 bucks. Boom, let's hope. I'm gonna check those right now. Yeah! Check that out, 25 bucks. Finally, finally found a good one. All right. That's good, that could mean that these also have money. Boom. All right, 30 bucks. 30 bucks on that one. Added it to my account. I think these are probably both real. 
Uh, not real, but you know what I mean. It's still loaded. I'm going to check those later. It's getting, it's already getting really, really hot in here. Then the furnace just kicked on because the air conditioning in the house. So, I, it's, uh, it's going to get warm. So I want to try to get through this as quick as possible so I can move in and do some of my other work in the house, such as editing. So, um, yeah, I'm going to keep it going. Next box. Next box. We got a handle. <laughs> Those stinking handles, they fall off constantly. That's cool. Monsters University. It's got a little tear right here, though. I don't know if is that the way it's supposed to be. I'm not, I don't think so. A girl can dream, it says. Hey, these ones are all pulled up, too, right here. Maybe that's the look. All right, Victoria's Secret. This is brand new in the bag, isn't it? Got some kind of Christmas socks. Maybe I can scan that code. We've done pretty well with some Victoria's Secret stuff uh, selling it online. Oh, look at this. More Victoria's Secret. Brand new in the bag. Pink. Looks like a shirt or something. Here's some boxers or pajama bottoms or something. All right, Warriors. <laughs> Adidas. Hat. Very nice. Gap sweater, American Eagle denim shirt. This is nice. It's Adidas basketball jersey. Steph Curry. That's pretty nice. It's a Disneyland sweatshirt right here. Ann Taylor. Another Ann Taylor piece here. This is a nice sweater. That's cool. Very, very nice. H&M Forever 21. Forever 21. All right. So a lot of regular stuff, but a couple nice pieces. Okay, next box. Got some license plates here. Different, two different ones. That's for a trailer. I think I have a license plate lot around here somewhere. Believe it or not, I have a license plate lot. All right, this is some horseshoes. This one feels like aluminum. It's light. This one, like, chromed out. And a couple decorative pieces there. Ooh, some more nail stuff. Nail collection. BC. Oh, more. All right. Huh, okay. All that nail polish that I brought home from my daughter to look at, she kept a good part of it. Basically, she kept most everything that wasn't dried up. She found plenty that she wanted to keep, so I was happy about that. She likes that kind of stuff. Microwavable uh, wax kit. Netgear modem. Franklin Speller and Dictionary. What's in here? Hmm. Let's see what's in here. Acrylic block set. Well, for stamps, I guess. Hair bands, it's good. Goody, it says. Goody. Oh, look at this, you guys. Okay, first of all, got a little bit of jewelry here. And look at that. Another lottery ticket. That's hilarious. Rosalie's 70th birthday. All right, we'll, we'll have to scratch that before this video is over. Here's some more stamps. Yeah, a few more stamps. Check this out. Got a whole bunch of cards that were stamped. Never mailed. She wrote the thank you to each of them. Handwritten notes. Never mailed them. How about that? Alright. Oh, look what we got here. Marvin Gaye. I do see some rap in here. Adventures of Stevie V. Eric Clapton. The Singing Machine. 8-track tape. We don't find that many 8-track tapes. Digital Underground. The Humpty Dance. Robert Palmer. These are in really rough shape. I don't know, guys. I don't mind auctioning off tapes, but these ones are pretty rough. Those might just go straight to the flea market. Okay, let's see what we got here. Man, this stuff is so tangled up. Got 36 cents. That's the winner. All right, let's see what passes the magnet test here. Okay. All right. Oh, they already scratched one off in the 88. Let's see if it's 888. Nope, 88. All right. So this is like the other ones we had found. You need to get three of a kind. Okay, 88. All right, guys. There's our chance. We need an 88 between these three here. Nope. Nope. Alas. This is my luck with gambling. This is why I don't gamble. <laughs> oh, well. All right. You know what kind of gambling I like to do? <laughs> right here. I like to gamble in storage lockers. That's the kind of gambling I prefer. All right, so 
Got some Forever 21 Express. Ann Taylor. Boom. Ann Taylor. All right, you know what I'm going to do with this? I'm going to put this aside and let Jana go through it. Ooh, Ann Taylor. I'll let Jana go through this, and she will decide what she wants to put in our auction for Monday. She's doing some really nice lots of clothes. So if you like the style of the clothes that you're seeing and your size is around the, you know, what, what these are, uh, which is actually kind of varied, but the mom wore mostly large, okay, large, yeah. Or if you're just a reseller and you think that this is up your alley as far as what you like to put in your store we have some good lots on monday all right next box this one is interesting so when i saw this in the in the locker in our locker after i moved everything i said oh that looks like uh school supplies which is good i'm like yay school supplies kids are going back to school sort of next week this is saving me money right here spiral bound notebooks it's all good that's what the kids need we seen this right if you saw the last video I spotted this through the box that looks like Michael Kors but first let's see what this is right here oh this is another Apple watch box wait a second this one's heavy too please be in here wow look at that look at the packaging it feels lighter now <laughs> there's just so many layers of packaging it feels packaging it feels yeah dang it Right. Take that out. But this, but this, but this looks good. Okay, what do we got right here? Oh, right, yeah. Michael Kors. Got a little scuff on the buckle there. So this one's been used a little more. Some of them we found were like impeccable, right? Perfect, perfect condition. The inside's clean on this. Inside's clean. Hmm. Very nice. This will make it to our auction, but you know what I'll do first? Oh, it's so cool. Look, at it. it's got the MK, but then it's got a little Michael Kors right there. <laughs> what we'll do first, we'll send, send this in and get it authenticated just to make sure. Bummer. Oh, man, you guys. Heartbreaker. I just noticed the zipper's busted. Look at that. It's missing right there. They took it right off. Oh, man, what a heartbreaker. That's a nice little purse otherwise. Mm. I was just about to say that's going to make it in our auctions, but mm. nope, not now. We don't sell broken stuff. Oh, it's, it feels like a snow globe. Oh, oh this is nice. Oh, no, Tink. Tinkerbell's head's missing. So sorry, Tinkerbell. So sorry. Bummer. All right, well, yeah, because these, these sell pretty decent. But yeah, not with the Tinkerbell head off. Off with her head. The Queen of Hearts got her first. All right. Well, anyways, that's it. Here I am. Starbucks. I'm gonna use that new gift card I just got. So um, yeah, I didn't. I'm realizing I didn't have very good stuff at home to unbox. I took home not exciting boxes. So you know what? I've got to run to FedEx. You see in the back of my seat here. I got a ton of boxes. A ton of boxes for both eBay sales and some other stuff. So. Um, I thought, you know what, let's just go to the locker and grab some more boxes. Why not? It's like 105 out right now, but why not? Let's go. Whoa. Okay, yeah, a little bit warmer than I even thought right there. Look at that. 109 out here in Livermore. Oh, my goodness. All right. I'm at my unit again. <laughs> Is this starting to look like a uh, Groundhog Day from yesterday's video? No, it is not the same video, all right? We're just back. We're going to start digging in some more of these boxes over here. Those are all fresh. These, I haven't really gone through them all, but they're mostly clothes and shoes. Some of them I went through, uh, but yeah. And on most of those are going to be shoes and clothes too. But let's try to see if we can find something a little bit better so we can film it right here on this table, all right? And I'm going to get the GoPro, and uh, I'll use that as long as I can before it starts warming up on me hopefully it doesn't burn a hole in my chest it'll look like iron man <laughs> all right that's funny this is like the third third box i found with these bags they definitely like to shop at victoria's secret right because i think that's pink that's their logo for pink yeah pink girls all right so yeah they definitely liked like that store okay here's some more pencils and pens Jeez. oh my goodness 
There's multiples of these, right? There's multiples of these. There has to be. I've already found, I thought I thought I found the same one twice. Now I'm like, no way. This is the third one of these I found. Oh, yeah. It's pretty good. Third one. Oh, wasn't even looking at that. Oh, what the heck? Right off the gate. I didn't even see that, guys. I didn't even see that. I get it. I get all blinded by the... <laughs> I get blinded by the, the slingshot. I don't even see the purse. I have a 10-year-old boy inside my head that does not seem to mature. All right, that's good, right? Really, really good. Here's a little Michael Kors purse. Very happy with that. And no broken zippers. So that gives it a leg up on the one we found earlier. Okay, what's in here? Oh, okay, sheets and pillowcases. School, school, what is this? Okay, microfiber cloth and some lens cleaner and a little screwdriver. Oh, it's for repairing your sunglasses or eyeglasses. How funny. Okay, oh, you think these go on my head? Oh my goodness, you guys. I was just thinking yesterday when I was here and I was dripping sweat into my glasses and I was thinking, I wish I had a, a uh, headband I'm not sure that's going to make me hotter or cooler. Ooh, you know what? I got an idea. Hang on. The ice I got at the uh, Bird King yesterday is all melted, but it's still extremely cold. Oh, that's nice. That is really nice. Look at that. Yeah. That is a game changer right there. Holy smokes. That literally brought my body temperature down by like 15 degrees. This thing is soaking wet in ice cold water. That is how we're going to do it today. Yeah, baby. Yeah. All right. Um, and then this one is going to be put aside because all of a sudden those got super valuable to me. To me. This is not a bad little box right here. Is this something good? Ivanka Trump. Okay. Ivanka Trump purse. I think that's probably decent. It feels pretty nice. I think her shoes are pretty expensive. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, that's good. It's in good condition. All right, that's two purses. Oh, that's good. Look at that. It's another free ticket. Free uh, pass to Cinemark? Yeah, Cinemark. Movie theaters. It's another prepaid admission ticket. Shower gel. Bath and Body Works. This is good stuff right here. Bath and Body Works. Very good stuff. Ooh, Hello Kitty. A little notepad. You know, this locker's so good. Let's give it a hand. Oh, okay. This is a little better. Nicer pens. Yeah, a whole bunch of them. We'll take that home and put it in our pen lot that we're building up. Steph Curry. Oh, what? No way, guys. No way. Oh, my goodness. This is like the third time we've hit cash. What the heck? When I picked it up, I was like, oh, this is thick and soft. The envelope. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. We've got some 20s in this one. Ooh. Twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, hundred, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one bucks, guys, thirty-one bucks. I'm sorry, hundred and thirty-one bucks. Uh, it's a little hot. Hundred and thirty-one bucks. A hundred and thirty-one bucks. Yes. <clears throat> Happy 13th birthday. Faux oh, show. Sure. All right, now we got to go slow. We always do, but maybe a little bit slower. Make sure I don't miss nothing else. 131 bucks right there. Oh, man. That turns it up, doesn't it? Started out pretty terrible at home with those boxes with the broken purse and all. 
Didn't take much. Turn that frown upside down. This is a liquid Reese's. I don't think they make them in liquid form. <laughs> it's just hot out here. It is hot. It's actually not as hot inside the storage unit. It's nice and dark and cool in here. Just hoping there'd be money in there. There's none. There is none. Please. Uh, that could be good. These a gift card. Okay, but it doesn't have anything on it, so it could also. And we never looked up that Starbucks from yesterday. Oh, okay, jewelers. All right. Oh, this is the same one we just sold. We just sold the same one the other night. This is 925 silver. The other one had a chain, but it was broken. Uh, so we just sold the pendant. We didn't sell the chain because we don't sell broken stuff in auction. But this is 925. They must have bought two, one for each of the girls. And this is the other one. Dang, yes. You guys get excited by this too? You get as excited when I find money? I don't know. It's, it's not your money. It's, it's my money, but it's not like that money's going to change my life or nothing. It's just the thrill of the find. That's really it, you know? It's just the thrill. So thank you. Thank you for giving me the money that I never used and just left in a storage locker and then didn't pay the bill. So some guy with a YouTube channel can come along and find it and get excited and make a video about it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, let's just take a peek in here real quick. Asics, great shoes. Toms. All right. Bear paw. Huh. Those look kind of cool. Okay, next box. Got more of these, like, uh, they're like uh, shoe bags or laundry bags from the hotels. And we got some pillowcases, and I think these are robes. Yeah, they're nice hotel robes, what they are. All right. Okay, you guys. Here's another box. So check this out. I just moved like a whole bunch of the clothes over here. I haven't gone through them. So I'm starting to just put all the clothes over here. I'm not going to bore you guys with too much more clothes. But we do need to go through it all. Hey, you never know when you're going to find out. Maybe a money envelope right in the middle of it. Or maybe some jewelry. Um, but yeah, we got to go through all the clothes and sort it out. There's still a lot of clothes over there. Um, but I had this box. Now this box, I don't remember if I showed it or not, because I know I consolidated this. When I was going through and moving that last day, I pulled all the paperwork out and I consolidated, co consolidated some boxes. This was one of them. There's a Justin Bieber and it's, it sounds full. All right. The key. The key, huh? Right, that's gonna go in our auctions. Uh, here's a glasses, Michael Kors. It says, and it says Michael Kors right there. Michael Kors. It says, and it says Michael Kors. Michael Kors on these ones too. Wowza. Okay, that one's just wrapped up right there. Okay, so that's good. Okay, yeah, compressed air. It's good. I use those all the time for cleaning stuff up before I sell it. All right, so. Yeah, but don't get excited, okay? You see these two boxes right there? Spoiler alert, they're empty, all right? I'm not going to act like, oh, let's open it and see. Oh, I'm so disappointed. No, I already opened them, and I already was disappointed. So when I was, uh, those were in boxes with uh, paperwork, so I had to go through them. But I did see all these cards, and you know what? Let's go through them real quick. Uh, roll the fast forward, because this is going to be boring. Nope. Oh, man. Okay. I got to do it, though, guys. I know a lot of storage guys that don't do that work. They don't go through this stuff. They might miss it. They might miss it. Yeah, this is cool. My girls like to do this stuff. I don't know if they're in this right now. They kind of go in and out of phases. I don't know. You know, I'll, I'll bring home, see what they think. There's a nice basketball. It's, it's their, again, their private school. All right. And da 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 da. MacBook Air. Boo, it's empty. Oh, man. Okay, and this one is another. This is a MacBook Pro. Okay, this is what I use from 
editing and everything. Nope, nothing. All right, not a big surprise. Okay, next box. Victoria's Secret. Victoria's Secret. Okay. Huh. Brand new with tags, huh? 78 bucks? What the heck? All right, there's another purse or bag or whatever you call it. Hola, amigo. Hoshizaki. Car Fox. That's silly. There's some film, Fuji film. Okay, question everything. I agree. Oh, come on. Be something good. What's this? Come on, it's nice. It's leather. The sack. Huh. The sack, huh? Alright. That looks pretty nice. Is that a good brand? I don't know. Okay. Ooh, marked by Mark Jacobs. Another nice little purse right here. Yeah. Daddy likes. Okay. Second, what's that? Inch of gold. I don't think these are gold. I think I found these before. They're like gold plated. I think I found this before. Inch of gold. Uh, but I'll bring it home. I'll check it out. But I think it's gold plated. And I realize I just repeated myself entirely. <laughs> That's cute. Whoa, that looks good right there. Look at that. Please tell me that's real. Coach? What? Well, the Coach Walt's better than the 20, but they got me at the 20. They had me at the 20, that's for sure. Oh, come on. That's, that feels real. Yeah, heck yeah. That's like, that's a 131, now it's 151 in cash. Heck yeah, but then look at this. We got this little coach wallet. What's in here? Just the tags. Sure enough, the stinking GoPro right there overheats and shuts itself off. I hope that video came in. I hope that video came in. Let's do the rest of it on the phone right here. I don't have, oh, I might have a, I might have something in here that I can hook the phone to. Uh, I was going to say, I don't have my tripod, but I might have something I can hook the phone to. But lo let's go through the rest of this box right now. All right, so hopefully that got picked up. I just found this Coach wallet right here with a $20 bill right in the window. Came in this bag right here. That's a good find. It's right in this box with, oh, look at that. A little old iPod. 8 gigabyte. How cute. We'll see if that works. Okay, there's a dime. And yeah, there's another iPhone cord, but it's you see it's got it's been compromised right there. All their cords are messed up to some degree. Oh, that feels really nice right there. That's heavy. Check this out. <laughs> some funky junk in here okay let's take a little pixie oh don't spill oh my goodness it's all quarters oh this is really good all quarters guys oh you see that drip <laughs> my headband's leaking do you see that my headband's leaking i just got it super soaked Oh, man, it's making a mess. But you know what? It's keeping me cool. All right, just 
cleaning out that little bin with the scrunchies and brushes, hair brushes and stuff. And I found this. That's nice. Lacoste. That's super cool. Nice little watch and a nickel. Woohoo. All right, this is kind of crazy. This is why you got to scan these in. I just found these three books in that last box. And um, so this one right here, Christian Morality, this is $20 on Amazon. That's worth it for me to list, which I did. I listed it right away. This one right here, Modern Chemistry. So I've, I've scanned so many textbooks out of this locker. I've had a few decent ones, like $20 to $35 hits. Um, but many, many, many are worth only a couple bucks because they're just outdated. This one, 72 bucks right here. 72 bucks. And the sell, the, uh, what do you call it? The Amazon rating ranking is very low on this, which means they sell fairly fast. This one also, the ranking is fairly low. $89. 89, 72, and 20. That's incredible, right? So what's that? Uh... $171 here if and when we sell them all. That's pretty good, though. You definitely got to scan your books and uh, see what you got. You never know where some you're going to pick up a little bit more revenue. Right here, it's in these three. Okay, guys. I think I'm just going to call it. I'm soaking wet. Partially, it's this thing leaking down. Partially, it's not. Um, it's, it's, it's hot. Like, seriously hot today. Um, and I was just here for a little bit, but that's cool because I didn't have very much excitement at home. I want to come over here and get my fix and get some good video to share with you guys. And we definitely did that today. Definitely just a few boxes and I found some major scores here. But uh, the bad news is we're getting, we're running low on potentials. Okay, just those back two right there. I've got a couple of stacks of cardboards in here. Cardboard boxes, like maybe like five or six boxes in here to go through that's it i expect maybe one oh and also those bins back there i know i already see a couple that we went through on the first day so um yeah maybe one or two more videos on this run unfortunately ah i want there to be a lot more because this has been super super fun but it is what it is um then i gotta get the selling and we gotta figure a way out to sell all these clothes all these right here i still gotta go through those and sell them i don't think that's video material but who knows? But um, if again, I mentioned this earlier in the video and I mention it often. If you guys uh, haven't been to our Monday night auction, definitely check them out because mon every Monday at 5 p.m. Pacific, we do live auctions where you can purchase some of the great stuff that we're, I'm finding in these units. And this time, obviously, I found a ton of great clothes, very high quality, very good condition. So we're going to lot those up. jana has been working on putting them in lots of the same size and um, kind of the same, you know, style or whatever, business attire, casual wear, whatever. Um, and so we're going to have some concisive lots of clothes. We're going to try that out, see how it goes Monday night. But I think with all these clothes, we'll probably be doing some sort of clothes in our auction for weeks to come. So, uh, yeah, check it out. All right. So I think that's going to be it. I'm going to... Uh, just clean up around here, put a couple bins in the car of the good stuff that I put aside and head on home and start editing this video for you guys. So um, anyways, I hope you have a great weekend. I hope that you stay cool. If it's hot where you are, it's hot here. And uh, thanks again for watching. Okay, the next video will be out soon. But until then, good luck to you. God bless you. We'll see you next time here on Locker Nuts. All right, I'm back from the locker. Let's check on the beast. beast. Well, hello. What's up? Hey, kitty. Hey. You miss me?